They, they're going to go head to head here. Rogers Bowser start the one two three. I think Bowser took the lead uh, after that 3200, having two uh, uh, one two finish. But uh, yeah, it could be a three team race here with Bowser. Well, four team race with Bowser's start, Rogers, and Scott the and final Scott team the final that will team, compete yeah. here in the three or the uh, four by four hundred meter relay. And as we, as we saw, Tom, one leg could make all the difference. We saw that in the, in the girls' version, and it was really, it all came down to the last leg. Interesting when you start looking at some pretty good runners that we've already seen today. Michael Lipkin's going to start for Rodgers. D'Angelo Sharpley, who you've mentioned, terrific runner, is running third for Bowser. Yeah, that's an interesting. And then Drew uh, Grigsby, who is... Uh, a pole vaulter, high jumper, but also an outstanding football player. He's going to run the anchor leg for Bowser, so this should be an interesting race. And there they go. As they make that first turn. They've got to stay in their lanes the entire lap. And once they make that first exchange, then the, they can go. Uh, the second leg goes around the curve, and then they cut in at the cones. You won't really see until we come off that first curve who's in the lead. It looks like Bowser. Yep, right now it's Bowser, Rogers, and Scott right there as well. Great job by Rogers coming from second place and a strong finish. Michael Lipkins, who we saw one earlier, giving uh, Bowser, or excuse me, Rogers the lead. It's quite a battle down to the end here. Yeah, as I mentioned, we saw the evidence of the uh, last race. You, you second and third runners for Bowser kept them in the race. And then Rachel Martyr was able to take control on that last leg and win it. And it, I, I feel that we're going to see something similar here in this race. Certainly agree with you there as Bowser and Rogers, they've now opened up a pretty good lead. And you can hear the crowd is really into this race, Tom. Yeah, I'm, I'm interested to see this third leg by Sharpley, who really can show his, uh, his his stamina in running. Let's see how he comes out on this and see if he sets up the anchor, Drew Grigsby, for the final lap. There he goes. And you can see him. They're putting on some speed and some showcasing right now. You want to show that speed in the back stretch, length of those strides. Wow. Great job by the Rogers runner to hold off sharply. That's Lipkins actually running here. Well, Lipkins was one of the bit. strongest runners. Look at this. This is only the third leg. Let's see what happened in this final leg. Great job by Lipkin to hold off sharply. And here you go, the final wrap. Cardi Jones running for Rogers. Drew Grigsby, as you mentioned, Tom, running in the fourth. Right in the fourth leg. What he's got to do is, is be patient. Uh, both runners make sure they have enough, enough uh, energy left at the end. But boy, I'm sure there's a lot of adrenaline going through them right now. Yep. And right now it looks like Rogers. The Cartier Jones. Ah, he's turning on the Jets now. Yeah, very strong finish by Jones. And Rogers wins the four by 400. Boys relay at a time unofficial of three.